President Adam Oboru has assured the Gambian military of his government's unflinching support and urges them to remain patient and allow the smooth process of the country's transformation process. Last year, the president promoted CDS Yankuba Drame, Deputy CDS Mamad Cham, Usman Gomez and Turo Jaune to the ranks of Lieutenant General, Mayor General and Brigadier General, respectively, addressing the nation's top four military officials on Friday as they received their rank symbol at State House. President Baru said, I will steadfastly continue to support and encourage the armed and security forces to be vigilant, flexible and responsive to threats and adopted to all circumstances within the confines of the law. The armed forces of a nation are an important aspect of its sovereignty and should be prepared enough to defend the people whenever called upon for duty. Therefore, the Gambia armed forces should be proud always to execute its duties with honor and patriotic services to the country, especially during the critical and sensitive process of rebuilding the nation and reasserting ourselves as a people. The Gambia leader added, I urge our gallant men and women in uniform and the entire defense and security community to remain committed, royal and alert while on the path of duty. We repose our trust on you and implore you to be patient and act with integrity as the necessary reforms of the holistic transformation of the country processes. Our common goal is a peaceful and progressive Gambia for all and with you, we can achieve that. He reminds the top GAF officials that the successful implementation of the security reform process will highly depend on their determination, professionalism and devotion to duty. His Excellency President Arama Baru added, Our history and experience has put us in a unique situation that demands striking a delicate balance between service and duty on one hand and discretion on the other hand. As a law enforcement and security agency, you should be confronted frequently with complex situations that require thoughtfulness and professionalism. This is particularly relevant as we transition into a new development phase while trying to reorient the people within the current fragile democratic environment.